Hello everyone, Chuck Northside Guy. Today sharing recent pickups and I have a nice stack of 17 cards here to share with you. Um, the concept today is one I wanted to kind of circulate and I uh, let, me, let me tell you what it's about. I, I'm moving in a new direction in the hobby and, and today I'm going to be sharing um, recent pickups that are all focused on 1950 Bowman. Beautifully centered examples. I'm looking to maybe build this collection in a high grade. But what set me off on this journey uh, of these beautiful cards is I have, um, as you know, a, a display case in my home office. And in earlier videos uh, on my channel, I have shared, you know, how I fill that display case. And I change it out about once a month. And it occurred to me that Maybe I should I, I can have mini collections. The display case holds about 27 cards, and um, I uh, I thought you know I can have a really nice mini collection, say of the 1950 Bowman or the 1915 Cracker Jack or T206 or 1954 Tops, and I don't necessarily need to buy the whole collection but I can have a really good representative sample. So what I thought is that gave me permission to build, at least start out building some mini collections, if you will, and then I can always make the decision whether or not to commit to go the full ride. You know, I'm coming up on the end. I have one card left with the 53 Bowman color. I have just a few cards, which are the Babe Ruth and Lou Gehrig cards, uh, and, and obviously the Lajoie card for the 33 Gaudi. And I've been hunting for particular cards this year, and they just haven't come on the market. Or if they have, they the, the cards I'm, I'm you know I set out looking for five cards this year, big boy cards, and they just have the ones I've seen just have not been to my liking. So I've I've been kind of itchy, um, you know, to collect. I've been selling a lot of stuff just to thin out the collection, but. Um, Anyway, I, I um, really love these 1950 Bowman cards. And I think what turned me on to it is that one of my big boy cards that I'm looking for is the Jackie Robinson of this set. And I, I started, you know, studying this set and recognizing that, uh, you know, there's a lot of really great artwork here. It's a classic era. By the way, this is, uh, I love this one because it's the ivy of, of Wrigley Field in the background here. So anyway, I'm, I'm 17 cards into the 1950 Bowman. Uh, you know, my immediate aim is to, you know, get about 27, 30 of these cards so I can have a display case month. Um, but I'll tell you, I just really love these cards and I can see myself going all the way. And there's about 252 cards, I believe. But I just wanted to really just share cards and uh, these happen to be some really nice examples. Most of them are very well centered. Uh, there's, there's, you know, like this Leo DeRocher. It's a touch, touch too much, uh, left, right, up, down. So let me know what you think uh, about uh, this idea of kind of a mini collection. You don't need to fully commit, but you can enjoy the set and enjoy the cards side by side of that set if you have your own display case. And uh, it's a way of maybe spreading your hobby dollars out and, uh, you know, enjoying more of these classic sets. So short and sweet today. Hope you enjoyed looking at these cards and uh, uh, I'll obviously be sharing more in the months ahead as I build this out and potentially other uh, years. Take good care, everyone. Bye-bye.